WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento for TFNN. Uh, Marcus sells off a tiny bit, really not very much at all. News uh, coming across from the Middle East is so horrific that anybody that watches should uh, turn off the sound because it's uh, bad enough to look at it. Let's just hear the rhetoric. Let's forget about that, talk about the markets. We're having a little bit of a sell-off in bonds. They're down a little more than a, almost two points today from the high. And then also we've had a little sell-off in gold, not very much so far. It's only come down about $17 from the uh, high in the gold, which is, of course, one half the harmonic in gold. And then also, if we take a look at uh, what's going on with the soybean market, folks, we talked about this yesterday on the show here about the soybean oil. It was such an important point, and also soybeans at the same time, and also wheat. We gave you some good ideas on that. We're going to cover those when we uh, finish our segment here. And then also our guest today will be Jeff Huge uh, at 1.30. And then tomorrow, folks, we're going to have a special guest again. Uh, Joe DiNapoli will be doing most of the show. We're going to be doing it together. And uh, hopefully you'll be able to listen to Joe. I've known Joe since 1968. And uh, he started trading at the Conti Commodity Office there on Wilshire Boulevard in uh, West L.A., Around the same time I did, I had been trading at, of course, across the street at uh, the uh, the other firm that was there. And I can't even remember the name of it right now. I, I will in just a second. Anyway, that's what will um, – oh, dear. It's the name of that the company. And uh, Oh, this is sad. Anyway, I'm not going to worry about that. I'm still under the weather a little bit, but doing better. I'm sorry about the videos, folks. I'm still not able to figure out how to send them to you. I'm hoping to get that done today or tomorrow to get the videos out and also the emails. I'm very sorry. There's just no way I can get this stuff out. A lot of technical difficulties along with the COVID, but I got that out of control, I think. I've had two days now where I feel about half human, so that's a good sign. So when we come back, we're going to talk about some of these markets that we're looking at right now on a technical basis. It has nothing to do with the politics or anything else that's involved about it. So I think it's one other thing you got to remember, folks. It's not how much money you make. It's how much money you don't lose, and that's the real key. We'll take a break here. We'll be right back. 